All right, boys, so we're fresh off of an uh, oppressive win. You know what I'm saying? Last week against Florida, complete instant class. It went to OT. We won it on a two-point conversion. And this week, it doesn't get any easier. We're going to be taking on number 25 ranked Georgia now. Even though they're 4-3, and three, they're Georgia, and we know they're not going to be easy. They're A-pluses across the board. We're B, B-minus B. Kirk's rolling with them. We got the number one scoring offense, number one pass offense, number one rush defense. We're tied for turnover differential. Take a look at our leaders. Alan Walters is actually playing really, really well right now. Samson State Brown doesn't have a lot of yards, but he has a lot of touchdowns. And then our boy Chris Pierce, the best receiver in the league, if you ask me. Eight touchdowns, 735 yards. Dimitri Moore leads us in tackles. Frank Coppett leads us in pick. Tid and picks. Tid leads us in sacks. Jake Fromm having a decent year for Georgia. DeAndre Swift doing his thing. Fitzpatrick. Um, you know what I mean? It is what it is. And their defense, nobody's standing out crazy. Um, you know our schedule, we've only lost to Bowling Green so far. I, I, that loss is really going to screw us. And in Georgia, they lost their first two games back-to-back, -back, the Clemson and Miami. They played the now one and two teams back-to-back. -back. Then they won the game. Then they lost to Arkansas by three. Then blew out Mizzou, beat Tennessee, and then beat South Alabama. We need to come out here and keep our same uh, intensity that we had, you know, off of the, the, the Florida game. Now, after the Florida game, some things happened that I, did, I wasn't necessarily prepared for. You know what I'm saying? We signed a lot of recruits. One, two, three, four, five, six. Now, the thing about all this is, if you guys remember in the beginning of the series, we came out with some recruiting rules. You know, one of the recruiting rules is we couldn't sign, you know what I'm saying, more than, um, more than I think it was five, four stars or higher in the season. Now, we got two ways to go about this. In the offseason, I'll have to... You know, as far as all the four stars and everything like that, I'll have to bump it down and cut people off of the squad and they won't be able to make the team. And or you guys can let me know in the comment section down below if I should say screw that one rule. You know what I mean? Just that one rule. All the other rules will stay, but screw that one rule because I kind of forgot. I didn't expect everybody to sign after that week, so it kind of threw me off. Y'all let me know in the comment section below and I'll probably also put a poll up on the, um, on the community. Now the remaining guys on the on the um on the recruiting docket, Tyler Jones, if we land him, we're not cutting him. We're keeping him. Number one quarterback in the nation, we need that. Chad Hunter, you know, four star free safety, a three star quarterback, four star receiver, uh three star receiver, three star uh, tackle, four star safety, and a three star athlete. So, you know what I mean, as you guys can see, we would have to cut a lot of people. But you know what I mean, I necessarily don't I necessarily don't want them to go to waste. But y'all just let me know because I could just keep them and, and go back to the rule next year and be a little bit more cognizant of it. But a lot of you guys told me I should have got rid of the rule in the beginning of the year. But you know what I mean? We're past that now. Let's get into this game. Asian for the fight. Can the Commodores come away with a victory at Georgia? We're on the road headed in the hostile territory down in Athens. All right, boys. It's a rainy one here down in Athens. Top 25 matchup here in Sanford Stadium. 25 versus 19. All right, so we lose the opening coin toss. You know what I'm saying? Um, I'm, I'm eager to see how Walters plays out here today. He had his moments against Florida. We're going to try to keep it on the, on the ground in this rain. And these some some of the, the top SEC schools, man, they're just too fast for us, dog. Baps continues to miss those key blocks on that on that, on that that screen. I mean, on, on that, ah, that stretch. But here we go. For some, reason, for some reason, Walters is always rattled like he don't be out here killing. Boom. You know what I'm saying? Cam Johnson stay in bounds. So, third and short is still the third and short. Nothing really hurt there. Need our guys to settle in. Boom. Make a miss. Oh, Bowler. Get him off you. Let's go. CJ Bowler is the man out here, dog. Take him for a rod. Let's go. 40-yard pickup, baby. In the red zone. Somewhere where we know a lot about. Now, Walters is calmed down. See if we can work uh, Chris Pierce over the middle. Boom, little check down. There we go. John Rodriguez inside the one. Samson St. Brown isn't the greatest running back. He isn't that quick or fast, 
But when we get in this red zone, he has a knack and a nose for the end zone. Boom. Speaking of that, in the end zone, untouched, and we strike first, baby. Let's go. Way to redeem yourself off that fumble. All right, second and ten. Watch out for the screen. We got we got hurt by the screen last game a lot. Just keeping it. Get there, fellas. Make a tackle. Yes, sir. White jerseys everywhere. You got to be kidding me, bro. Dimitri Moore saving a touchdown there with that tackle. Like, uh, but this, this is what makes it difficult. I, I, can only, I can't click off of my defenders, man. I got to try to let the computer make a play. Of course, I could have easily made that play, but that's ridiculous. We had that play completely stuffed out, completely snuffed out. You know what I mean? We let him get something out of it. DeAndre Swift keeps it, and we finally bring him down. Like, our number one defense, rush defense, definitely ain't on display today. Here we go, fellas. We're only going to rush two here. Make a play. Woo! Let's go, fellas. That's what I'm talking about, Haney. Make plays out there. Oh, let's go. Field goal is missed. Defense comes up with a huge stop, baby. Way to lock in when we needed you to. Second and three. Here we go. Let's see if they're a man or a zone. Cam Johnson in motion. They are a man, but I'll take my chances there. Get that extra blocker out there. There we go, Baps. Making the right block, baby. That's what I love to see, fellas. Come on, Chris Pierce. Do you. Got him. Woo! What a throw. Usually, you know what I'm saying? I feel like a quarterback of a... Uh, of Walter's caliber will underthrow that, but that was actually a good ball. It was a little bit behind him, but only where his his guy can get to it. First and goal here. Keep it on the ground. It's nice and simple. Sansa say Brown, can he find the end zone? He stopped just short. Let's run that back. There we go. I got you, Pierce. Way to sit down. Soft spot. They thought we were going to keep it on the ground again, and we strike again. Allen Walters is seven, seven for seven in this game right now, man, with a touchdown. I like it. I'm loving it. He threw like three or four picks last game. We're going man up here. We're not going to press, though, because we don't want to get beat that badly. Man in motion. I see it. Ah, I just couldn't get there. I couldn't break down on it quick enough. I seen that, too. Let's go back to man. I'm liking, I'm liking the way we're looking right now in man. Pick that off. Oh, I could have picked that off if I could click off. All right, let's go, fellas. Keep it. Bang! Oh, I wanted to hit him harder than that. But Hebert is always in the backfield for the most part, man. That's where he makes a bulk of his tackles. All right, you already know. We sell out for the run. We sell out for the run this third down. Make the tackle. Yo, Jake Fromm is really Tebow out here, bro. This dude is really Tebow out here, bro. Like, honestly. And we let him off the hook. Uh, a stop there would have really, really put us, you know what I mean, over the edge. But it is what it is. See if we can, we can stretch the field with Pierce here. Ooh, gotcha. Stupid. Give me that. Ah, bowler. They didn't give me a catch animation. I forced it. That's our first incompletion of the day, too. I try, I had to give my receiver a chance to make a play. I just I just took the, a bad route to the ball. He cut it, he undercut it. Our empty backfield here. Looking for this, looking for a screen. Pick that off. There we go, cop it. That's why you lead the squad in picks. I was so tempted to click off, but I got to stay disciplined. And the computer came through and made a play for us. We throw a pick. We come right back on the next play and catch one of our own, baby. Let's go, number two. We're really proving that we can play man to man now, man. Last year, we couldn't do that at all. So we've definitely gotten better there. Cam. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, wheels, baby. Wheels. He turns into that return man once he makes that first person miss. You feel me? Let's go. Nothing nothing comes out of being scared. Scared money don't make money, bro. Y'all know what's up. Gotcha. Bang. Chris Pierce once again, baby. Come on now. All right, here we go. First and ten. Office is looking beautiful out here. Pierce is open. Do not overthrow him. He doesn't. These two dudes are so in sync, dog. It makes no sense. These two dudes are so in sync, bro, and I love it. Chris Pierce, you know, he just got converted to a tight end this season. And, um, you know what I mean? We may we may be, have just made him a lot of money by converting him to a tight end. Oh, I forced that. Woo, Chris Pierce makes the play. The, the, the corner, 
You know what I mean? He pawned off the receiver. That kind of threw me off. But we're not kicking a field goal, man. Y'all know what time it is. We we try to score touchdowns out here. Field goals do nothing for us. Got him. Woo! Get in the end zone, baby. Oh, they cheat. They hold him. They hold him. Wow, that should have been touchdown number three. Way to get the ball there. Come on, Samson. We need you, big dog. We need you, big dog. Big boys up front. In the end zone, his second TD of the day. Let's go. Let's go back to man. Man is where we've been eating at today. We've been making a lot of bread and butter there. Oh, yeah. Make the tackle. Oh, my gosh. Come on, computer. There we go. It's a screen. Give me that right, my arrow. We got to catch those. We got to catch those. And I clicked on you by mistake. Like, I switched on you right before the play started trying to get to Haney. All right, guys. 28-7 here. 3.15 left in the first half. See if we can continue to eat, man. Come on, CJ. Break the tackle. Doing what you do best, baby. I just wish we had more wheels, dog. Inside the red zone. Bang at the 15. 53-yard pickup there for CJ Bowler. We take what the defense gives us, and we continue to torch them, man. We're 4 for 4 in the red zone today. All touchdowns. Switch that up. See if we can get John, Ro John Rodriguez. Dot! Chris Pierce with touchdown number three, baby. Come on now. You would think they would account for him out, of, you know what I mean, off the line. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's too easy. That's just, that's just a normal pitch and catch right there. Right over the linebacker's head, in front of the safety. Easy six. Got a little bit too overzealous there. I see in the route, nothing I could do. Stiff arm the hell out of my DB. Had to pick one. I didn't know which one I was going to have to try to make a tackle on. He's still up and still up, and we finally bring him down. I seen that route. Just getting eaten up, man. I knew I should have been on the other safety. Now they're using our, our, our cockiness against us, against us here a little bit with the man to man coverage, but we're going to stay in it. Draw play all over it. Colin Anderson in the backfield, baby. Let's go. All right, here we go. Third and five. Come on, Uriah. Oh, he getting super blocked, and we still make the tackle. Ray Meyer makes the tackle. Let's go. Do they go for Do they go for six or do they go for the three? All right, so we're gonna take our time out here. That's our last one. I don't have any because I kept press, pressing go for two by mistake. If I didn't have to bonehead, you know what I mean, use those timeouts on such a bonehead stuff, we we could really really probably score here. Got one. It's underthrown though. Wow, we got lucky. We got lucky there. Pierce Watt, yo, come on. Like, how does that happen? I'm not upset that it happened, but you know what I'm saying? I see them walk the safeties down. Like, we're trying to score points. All right, here we go. We can't get, we can't take a sack here, or else we come away with no points. Really, nigga. Ah! Instead, we throw a horrible pick. We throw a horrible pick instead. It's all good. It's all good, man. I'm willing to take a shot there. I didn't see that safety breaking down on the ball. That's on me, man. That's what's going to take us to the locker room. So we head into the locker room up 25. Nothing hurt with the pick. We're going to turn the ball over a little bit. You know what I'm saying? So let's see if we can just keep this intensity up in the second half. Maybe we'll try to run the ball here. This is why you keep your starters in late in games, bro. They got to be able to play through this stuff. There we go. Come on, Cam. Been a minute since we got you to rock, baby. Hey, four seconds. We're going to run one last play. I see the blitz coming. Make somebody miss. Way to hold that block up there. Ah! That's going to take us into the fourth, man. Get them fours up, ladies and gentlemen. You know what time it is, baby. Let's go, man. We got we, we, we pretty much got shut out in the third quarter. We only came away with three. You know what I'm saying? We got we to gotta really pour it on here in the fourth. So why is this why your starter stay in the game? Like I said, though, man, you're like, you're like we got it. We got it. The offense has to run smoothly. Flush out of the pocket. Can we do it with our legs? We do just that. Alan Walters finds the end zone. Let's go, man. Thank you. All right, guys. So that's going to do it. Clock is triple zeros. This is a weird, weird game. You're going to see some weird highlights, bro. 
Um, you're probably not going to see that much of the second half because the second half just wasn't a good half for, for either team. It was kind of a waste. So we're going to go ahead and knock out a doubleheader for you guys today. Just real quick, looking at the score summary, you see we only put up we put up 13 in the, in, the, in the second half, but it was ugly, like nothing really crazy like we did in the first half. Final game test, Allen Walters, 24 for 45, 476 yards, three touchdowns, two picks, 53 completion percentage. Deuce Wallace came in in garbage time and threw two picks somehow. Uh, rushing wise, Samson St. Brown, two touchdowns on the ground. Allen Walters had one. Receiving wise, Chris Pierce led us with 10 for 185, three touchdowns. Cam Johnson, 7 for 150. CJ Boulder, 3 for 98. John Rodriguez, 2 for 22 and a drop. Defensively, Brandon Harris led us in tackles with 7 all solo, followed by Haney and Anderson with 6 all solo. Moore had 5 4 solo, 2 for loss. Uh, 5 all solo for Dante Williams. We had 5, 7, 9. Uh, 11, 10, I mean, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 16 tackles for loss as a squad, bro. That's absolutely insane. We had two sacks, 10 and Reitmeyer. Then we had two picks, Frank Coppett. You know what I'm saying? The squad is looking good, man. So hopefully we can come out here next game and uh, continue this intensity. That's how you start off a game, Cam Johnson. All right, man. So here we are back on the road against Missouri. See our impact player, Allen Walters, played great except for the two picks last game. Now it's time for us to come out here and try to get, you know, uh, another win in a row. We're on, we're on quite the win streak. I forgot the exact number. My apologies. We won one, lost one, and we haven't lost since. So let's go. Come on, Chris. Doing what you do. Eh. Racking them up already. We definitely need to finish this game a lot better than we finished the last. Why is Allen Walters rattled, bro? Like, there's no reason for him to be rattled. He's one of the best quarterbacks in the nation. Hands down. And he's showing it off right here. Oh, no. We don't get the six. That's crazy. Wow. They, horrible ball placement there, but it's all good. Time for Samson to find the end zone like he does so well. Boom. He's going to walk in there untouched. Barely. We got six, man. Let's go. Come on, defense. What are y'all going to do out here today? Empty backfield set. And we get torch first play. Dimitri Moore was one-on-one. -on -one. And we give up a big play, 34 yards to start off the game. Here we go, first and 10. Still an empty backfield set here for Missouri. Come on, pick that off. Wow, he just mossed you. The crazy thing is we're in dime. We're in pass coverage. And we're still getting torched out here. Like, it's not even close. All right. Well, all right. Finally, we get an incompletion here on this drive. No screen. Pick. Oh, you got to catch that. You got to catch that. Come on, baby. Allen George, I need that. We keep him off the board that way. Come on, Cam. We need another big one, kid. Another big return. There we go. Man, this dude is easy to return her the year. Damn. Bam! 53-yard pickup, man. Oh, wow. Coach Coach told us to go for it anyway, the coordinator. I was going to override him, but you know what I mean? Let's get it. Let's pick it up, fellas. I see that blitz coming. Dot. Come on, now. Y'all know, y'all know we're gonna go for, we're gonna find them if y'all even give us a little bit of a seam to get the ball to him. Good throw, Walters. All right, here we go. Second and seven, in the red zone once again. We're here a lot. Oh, we broke the tackle and dot. Oh, perfect throw, breaking tackles, but he can't get his feet in. Liking what, liking what we're doing right here. Watch out for the screen. Oh, he went to him anyway. Luckily, he dropped that. I stopped chasing him because I was like, he's not throwing him the ball. But he did, and he dropped it. Let's go. Offense has not been looking good the last few quarters of football we've been playing, bro. Not at all. Stay in bounds, John. Mm. I see you. Dot. Hey, Cam Johnson with six, baby. 28-yard touchdown throw and catch. Almost didn't see him, but he got separation from his deep from the DB, and we punched it in the end zone, baby. That's what I'm talking about. 
Alan Walters, man, keeping the plays alive, throwing a strike in the rain, knowing he was going to get lit up. <laughs> All right, second and 18 after that bad sack there. Boom, make the blocks. Yeah. If Simpson St. Brown had some wheels, bro, like if he had Cam Johnson's wheels, this play would have been over a long time ago. But he still gets a big gain inside the red zone. Stays up, forced out of bounds. Let's go. Where to use their own, uh, you know what I'm saying, their own aggressiveness against them. Alan Walters is in the zone right now. Boom, good read. He keeps it. Truck somebody. Yes, sir. Get off me. Get out the way, little man. Our wins ain't always pretty. Our offense isn't always perfect, but man, oh, man. Like, we just have we have those intangibles, man. We're, we're a tough, uh, tough, gritty team. No? No blocks out there, Bats? Nope. No blocks? Okay. Gotcha. All right, second to go. Get in there, Allen. Big boy run. Let's go. Let's watch out for a screen here. I want to pick, man. We... I can't say we haven't caught a pick in a while. We had two last game. Hmm. I would have taken that fumble, too. Third and 15, man. You know what time it is. Either screen or... Come on, Allen. Sorry, I, I, I don't know why. I just... Instincts made me click off. My bad, fellas. But we didn't make catch the pick. All right, here we go. See if we can make, make shake here. You Look, get it there. suck. As soon as I say we don't have any turnovers yet, of course I throw one, bro. Just forcing a bad pass instead of just throwing the ball the hell away, man. Just keeping it. I try to get off of it with more daily. Oh, wow. I click off and I, I do worse than the computer this time. Forgetting I'm not supposed to click off. Every time I feel like we can possibly shut a team out, we always just let them back in the game, bro. Oh, we all over that play, though. Let's go, Dimitri. I'm right there. Let's go, Hebert. This is what he do. This is what he does, man. Make plays in the backfield. We do this, fam. Let's go, baby. Third and goal. Didn't even know I hit my mic. No, sir. No, sir. Got him. Get it out there. Yes, sir. That a boy, man. Take what they give us, fam. All the time. Every single time. Go ahead and audible about it is. Gotta get it there. Yes, sir. What another what a throw. What a throw from Alan Walters, man. That throw, that throw can only be made in one spot. And he made it there in that spot. We're going man up here again. Let's go. Picked off computer. Allen George made that play. Let's go. That's usually a play I make as a user. You better beat him to the end zone. You bum. Come on, Allen. I was going to juke, but I figured you could you could catch the corner on him. But way to be heads up. Break off your route. Come back down. Make the play. Let's get it, man. All right, we'll go first and go inside the 10 to start off. First play. Boom. Allen Walters keeps it. Get into the end zone. Untouched, baby. Too easy. Too easy, dog. We are really coming into our own, man. Year two. All right, boys, so we're heading into the locker room, up 32 points. We're going to go ahead and super sim, and hopefully we can keep this lead. Hopefully nobody gets hurt, and then we're going to get up out of here for today's video. All right, we go super sim to the end of the game, and okay, defense holds up. This is what the offense doesn't really do anything when I don't play. That'd be the thing that pisses me off. You know what I'm saying? Like, we, I would score a lot more points on this squad, but the offense, of course, is going to play differently without me. And all right, so they're only down 14. Can we, can we get some points? If they score here, I'm coming back. All right, 50 seconds left, man. This is this is why I don't super sim right here, bro. This is why I don't super sim. Like I, it's going, like it happens every single time. Every single time, bro. And I'm an asshole about it too. Why would I? Oh, uh, why would I do that, bro? That's our first turnover of the game, too. And this is just me forcing a pass for no reason. All right. Now this game has some substance to it. Let's go. Picked off. All right. What a good defense, though. Good defense. 
Uh, why would I? Why would I do this to myself? Knowing what was going to happen out of this, bro. Like an offense really couldn't do anything without me in the game, bro. Y'all see how fluid? Like the momentum should rub off when I when I when I get off the sticks, bro. Little quarter, little half. I mean, we're receiver screen. We make the tackle. First time out is used. All right, let's go. I'm rocking out on the line right now. I'm about to give me a sack. Pause. Make the tackle. No? Oh, wow, computer. I'm clicking off because they want to hold me. They want to hold me so bad in this game. They want to hold us so badly in this game, dog. This is crazy. Wow, I don't know who that was to, but okay, I'll take it. Super Sim really just let these dudes like they down 32 points. Nobody, there's not teams don't just come back down from 32 like that, bro. As they make it seem. Make a tackle, please. I'm clicking off. I'm not. I'm not trusting the computer. I couldn't trust them to to seal the deal on the Super Sim. So let's go. 10 seconds. Nine. They're gonna score too. I can feel it. I guarantee you they're gonna score here on this last play. Oh, we get to the QB. And we end it just like that. Let's go, baby. It's not as, imp as impressive as a win as it should have been, but a win's a win. I wasn't about to sit here and have over two and a half hours of gameplay, man. Allen Walters, despite the two turnovers, you know what I'm saying, did his thing once again. He's making himself known. You know what I mean? He's putting his name up there with the elites this season. You know what I mean? 14 for 25, 295 yards. We could have did a lot better than that, but if ands and buts, horse, you know, almost only counts the horseshoes and hand grenades, bro. So, scoring summary, we got shut out in the second half with the Super Sim. Insane. Never seen nothing like it. All right, man. Final game stats, Allen Walters, 14 for 25, 295 yards, two touchdowns, two picks. Um, on the ground, Samson St. Brown, 26 for 55, a touchdown. Allen Walters, 9 for 61, three touchdowns. Receiving, C.J. Bowler, 5 for 87. Uh, Chris Pierce, one of his worst games, four for 43. Cam Johnson, three for 83, a touchdown, one for 11 for Rodriguez, one for 71 for St. Brown. Defensively, Hebert led the team in tackles with 10 all solo, four for loss, eight all solo for George and Moore, six all solo for Ted, five all solo for Daly, four all solo for Coppett. And we get another W, man, and we continue to improve. And we keep the win streak alive. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this episode, man. If you did, stop and smash that like button. Hit me up in the comment section below. Subscribe if you're new. It's your boy Uncle Sam's Reject, ArcadeGames.com. I'm out of here. Peace. I want to give a special shout out to our Heisman sponsor, Isaac Johnson.